Elisha? Uh, there's kind of a kind of a hint in the story that this is Hello and welcome to my desk. I've got tons of editing to do today, so we're just gonna go ahead and get right into that. Okay, I just finished editing a video for, I think it's going to be out probably before this one, so I'll link it up there, but yeah, that took me a while, so I don't really know what I'm going to do now. Why would you put that there? No, there's definitely just right now. I'm just saying. What? Simply begging the question. I forgot to vlog it earlier, but we redecorated the living room to make room for this giant new floor TV that will eventually not be a floor TV. And so yeah, I'm gonna show you that. So late, everybody. Love vlog. How are you? Very, um, Trinity's here so we can watch Christmas movies. The Christmas vibes are strong. I got my fuzzy socks on. It's a good time to watch a Christmas movie. Yeah, Pew! Pew! I'm kicking Mark in the camera. Pew! Pew! Because he played Tetris without me. That was rude. I'm going to squish your face. Pew! Pew! Good morning everyone, welcome to my kitchen. It is now Sunday and I think that I am going to impulsively reorganize the whole thing. I've been eyeing it for a few weeks now and I think today's the day I do it. So that's what we're gonna do right now. I'm just gonna start by giving you a little tour of the kitchen as it is and show you like some of the things that have been kind of irking me a little bit. My roommates like literally don't care, but I care so much, so I'm gonna show you. Okay, this is our cupboard, and it has all of our food for the whole house. All of our, not our spices, but literally everything else. All of our baking foods. We've got like top ramen and rice and bulk foods. And then we've got like our snack foods up here, teas, everything is in here. And then when you come over here, we've got the stove. Up here we've got some like bulk spices and then we've got like wrapping paper up there because there's nowhere else to put it and then over here this is an area I'd really like to like give us a little bit more counter space by maybe clearing this off somehow we got pot holders spices and things down here this is our roundabout of random stuff that doesn't go anywhere else you guys hear the smart car woo smart car so that's that and then we've got pots and pans and oh see tons of plates and then Tupperware and bowls 
And then Zoe's mom gave us a whole bunch more Tupperware that's just straight up not going to fit in there right now. So that's an issue. We've got silverware, knives. This is like such a mess in here. We've got kitchen aid things and all of our mixing utensils, but also measuring cups and colanders and stuff. And then down here, this is our drug drawer of prescription drugs, first aid kits, stuff like that. Under the sink, there's not much going on. It's just cleaning supplies. I feel like that's pretty standard and okay. We got dishwasher stuff and all of our cups are in here and we've got a random waffle maker up there and then some couple of little random things on top of the fridge then when you come over here past the pantry we've got our microwave and we've also got some random stuff over here and then there's just like this huge pile of bags over here next to our ice machine and an extra bag of rice so it's kind of chaotic and I want to have it not be chaotic. got rid of all the bags I put them under the sink and then this is just kind of stuff that we don't really use that often so that it's still accessible but not like part of the regular kitchen so much so like blenders we don't really use muffin pans a donut maker stuff like that just specialty foods then up here is exactly the same I just wiped it down and we've still got Anthony Bourdain love ya okay over here I consolidated the food up to the top and then left the bulk foods down at the bottom. But here we've got all of our pans and stuff. So I don't know if we'll keep this. I'm not sure how I feel about it, but I think it's an improvement. And then if you come over here, I changed the aesthetic of it a lot. So I love the way this looks. This is gorgeous. And then in here, I put all of our Tupperware. And in here, we've got still the same bowls and plates, but there's just more space in here now. And the way I consolidated the food is I put all of our baking stuff and like teas and spices down here. And that's also how I consolidated like so there's less stuff on the counter by putting the spices down there. And then moving these, I just put thumbtacks in the wall and so I could hang these up instead of having them sitting on our counter. And then I didn't really touch the top and bottom drawer, so they look pretty much exactly the same. But there's more space in here now. I don't really know how that happened, honestly. I think I moved some stuff around in there. Under the sink looks mostly the same. And then in here, we still got cups and bowls. I put colanders and a cheese grater and stuff up there. So yeah, that's what it looks like now. And I think that it's still a little wonky, but it is better than it was before. So this might be something I come back to again in a couple months, but I think for now, I'm gonna test this out and see how it works, see if my roommates like it. We'll see. Okay, I know I haven't vlogged much today, but I vlogged a lot yesterday. And honestly, the rest of the night's gonna be pretty boring. I'm just making top ramen right now and I'm gonna eat it while I finish my audio engineering project and then I am going to probably watch TV for the rest of the night before I buckle down next week for finals so I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here thank you so much for watching I will be vlogging again for finals week and I've got lots of exciting videos coming out this month so be sure to subscribe if you liked this video that is all I'll see you later okay thanks bye wait I just that's totally a Tiffany Berg thing. Sorry, Tiffany.